Okay, hi everybody, welcome to a SketchUp for Schools tutorial. This is a web-based 3D modeling software from SketchUp and we're gonna make this simple car in 3D. So I'll show you how to use uh, shortcut techniques to edit edit edges, points and and 3D shapes. So let's make a new file. And pick your units and we will be using let's go with millimeters and I'll save this. Okay, so we'll delete that guy. We'll start by Click on shapes, pick rectangle, and if you press the P tool, you can pull the shapes up. Okay, first thing we'll do, we will draw, drag, drag the front edge back for the the front of the car. If you press M, you can move. So when you move, you can press up. It can move up and down, press down, it can move forward and back or left and right to move in left and right direction. So I'm going to press back, I'll move this back to about there and we're going to go to the back, do the same. Okay, next step we'll just Pull this model, I'll go press P, pull this halfway, so we will only model half the car and then mirror it across. To select all, you triple click, pre um, press three clicks quickly to select the whole model, it turns all blue. Alright, next step, we we'll move this across there, and one more thing for for the front we will draw draw a little lip on the bottom here so I'll click on the edge here okay to move okay, click on the edge move and move it back slightly there all right let's make the roof so I will draw a line here and a line here and let's pull this up just slightly and we'll pull this back so it's on a diagonal so to move press the M tool to go to the move tool select the arrow to select and I'll move this across I'll move the bonnet the middle of the bonnet up to move up you can simply drag up or to make sure it goes up press the arrow up and I'll make this bonnet go up as well press up okay all right to make it look more realistic we select the windshield middle line and the front middle line and I'll drag this forward and we can move points as well you don't select anything press the move tool and put your cursor on the point and then you can drag the points and I'll move this point back you can redefine the, this surface here I want this this surface to go the other way so I'll delete the face and draw that in again okay next step I will move these forward slightly all right there you go starts to look like our car already all right what else so I think that's actually turned out all right already so we 
we'll just mirror that across let me fix this surface here delete I'll redefine this surface with this going the other direction and all right now we'll triple click select everything we can group right click you make it a group and we could copy and paste actually I'll ungroup first explode so I'll copy and paste and then I'll group it so I'll move it over here and then I'll go right click flip along the red axis and, and then I'll move this into this point here select the exact point so it sits exactly on the point there and there you go and now if we triple click all our, our cards join together okay looks good all right now we'll group everything so it doesn't break up and then I'll add I'll show you how to make the ties so we go select circles from shapes here put on the surface click and drag it up and pull that out and one thing one useful thing to do with this is we can scale so if I select this surface I can go to in, in the move tool we have scale here if you, if you scale and hold shift I think so if we hold control and ALT it centers on the middle point and we're gonna move that So we're going to make a little chamfer there and I'll move this out and then I'll pull this face. Press the P and we can pull that to make that the tire. And I'll move this in just about there. And then I can group it. And make copy and paste. I'll click on this point so it sits on the on exactly on top. And then I can move this down. I press left so it aligns up with that edge. And I'm going to bring this across to the other side. So select both and press Ctrl C, Ctrl V to copy and paste. Click on this point so it sits exactly on top. top. And then we press right, make it move along the edges so let it sit there and we're going to right click flip along, along the red axis and we have our car model there you go looks good now we just paint we've got a paint bucket here click on paint bucket and i'll paint the tires so when you paint when it's in the group mode you, you paint the whole thing if you want to paint the surfaces, you're going to go into the group, select the paint color, and then this in when the group mode, there's little bounding boxes here that shows we're in the group. We double click to go into the, the group mode. All right, and we're done. There you go. We click double click outside, and we have our car model. And save your work. SketchUp car. Okay, there you go. Have a great day. Hope you enjoyed that video. Have a play around. Try it yourself. Make sure you subscribe and like. Have a great day.